How's it going folks? Jordan64 back again. Uh, it's been a bit, but I promised a video and you know, here it is. I am just now at the time of recording this, I'm getting off of work and I'm about to start uh, a week vacation from work. I'm not really going anywhere. I haven't really planned anything. At least as of yet, I mean, that could change in a week, but for the, you know, for the most part, I have the next week off from work. Uh, so that basically means it's time for me to play catch up. So as the video states, uh, I wanna go ahead and give you guys the rundown on what I have planned for the rest of 2024 and beyond. Um, this is pretty much gonna be impromptu. I have thought about making uh, a video like this for quite some time because I promised I'd keep you guys in the loop of what's going on. Uh, last you guys saw of me, of course, that was in a YouTube short. And it was basically me, you know, saying that I personally just need to take a mental break away from like having to consistently try and do some uploads, reset myself, focus on the family life, all that stuff, focus on my health as well. So for the most part, that's all been good, taken care of, and things are just, you know, still rolling along. Everything has been going great. Sorry that my camera isn't so steady. Uh, I don't, I, I'm literally sitting in my car if you, if you guys can't tell. So here's the rundown um, of what I have coming up. I have this, next, like I said, I have this next week off, so I wanna go ahead and utilize that time to you know, potentially just focus on doing uh, uh, some uploads here and there. I don't know if it's gonna be every day, it might be, there might be a break, I don't know, but I wanna get um, some projects out of the way. I mentioned this in a post, if you guys haven't seen it, I mean, I'll go ahead and, and share with you guys what's to come. So I, I wanna go you know, break down one by one what I have planned uh, for each of my projects. So let's start with Smash Bros Ultimate. Um, those have been pretty simple videos. It's been getting, you know, a decent amount of views, a little bit more than what I kind of expect. Some in the high hundreds, some above that. Um, and I'm guessing it's just you guys, you know, possibly just watching your favorite character go through classic mode. I just feel like, you know, it's something as kind of an archive for me because I don't know if I'm ever gonna get back into Smash Bros at all later down the road, if they come out with a new game or whatnot. I just wanna have something to kind of look back on, you know, should, uh, you know, should I say I give up gaming? I, I, I don't think I'll ever give up gaming, but I know life goes on. I'm not getting any younger as you can tell, which by the way, yeah, this thing has fully grown back. I know since the last time you saw me, I was clean shaven, but now it's back. So yippee ki -yay. What really kind of, you know, this is kind of the backstory of, you know, Smash Bros having to do with me taking a mental break. Um, so the last video I posted for Smash Bros was of Ryu, with Ganondorf being the next one that was gonna be my next upload. I had, you know, high hopes of having that one done, that video, plus another one after that. Uh, it turns out there has not been any audio in that video whatsoever. Apparently I must have hit record and I forgot to turn on the game volume on my OBS. And so the whole playthrough went through and there was no sound. And I was just so kind of frustrated with it that that's kind of what jump started me like saying, hey, I need to take a break. Cause it was like, obviously that little thing, I don't know, it kind of set me off a little bit. Cause I didn't, cause I mean, obviously I'm going to re-record it. I'm not gonna upload it with fancy smanchy stuff. Um, like, via, like music in the background or whatnot. I'm just gonna re-record that from scratch. I, I will eventually have those up. That's gonna be obviously the next step is I am going to finish all Smash Bros. I have finally finished classic mode with every character. Um, I finally finished that last week. So all that's recorded, it's gonna get edited probably, um, you know, a few, probably over the weekend I'll get those done. And then I'm gonna jump right back into Super Mario Bros. Wonder. So I'm gonna jump into that. Um, there are a few videos I've already recorded um, from I think about a couple months ago. Uh, so once I finish the Smash Bros series, I'm gonna go back into Mario Bros. Wonder, edit the videos that I do have done, and then jump back into it because I still need to beat the game. It's almost been a year since that game came out and I have not beaten it. I need to beat it. So that's my goal is to get that done. Once I'm done with that, 
and get it all edited and recorded and uploaded. Then I'm gonna finish the Mario Kart series. If you guys are familiar with that, uh, with that series, uh, it's a challenge that I do in Mario Kart 8 Deluxe called the Kart versus Bike versus ATV Challenge. I take basically one track. I'm going through every single track in the game, including the booster course pass, which I, I honestly can't wait to get into those booster course pass tracks because a lot of them are very fun. Uh, but basically I take those tracks and I basically race them one time in the cart, one time in the bike, and one time in the ATV style. Um, and basically pretty much do some sort of like time trial kind of thing to see which vehicle is is best to use for that course basically these videos are inclined to help those newer players that are just now getting into mario kart of course a lot of younger ones um, that are growing up with this game i mean this game that's 10 years old for goodness sakes um, and basically just help them out a little bit you know give them just kind of some helpful hints on you know racing the tracks um obviously not breaking down anything with like items specifically but you know use utilizing because it is time trials you just utilizing the mushrooms for certain shortcuts showcasing them it, it's supposed to kind of help teach those you know newer players kind of how to play the game a little bit so uh that's that's the whole reason why i've been doing that series since i think i started in 2022 if i remember correctly it's been a while so um, I, I'm ready to finish that. Uh, so those are basically the three main projects that I have to finish because I want to get back into streaming and that's the next big thing that I have planned afterwards. I want to get back into streaming. Um, now obviously with how my work schedule is, how my sleep schedule is sort of you know so to speak i'm ready to just stream whatever i want um you know i've i've tried so many different things over the years such as playing either newer games or playing some more interactive games like mario kart or or splatoon in the past or even smash bros like i did in the past um it's real nice to have those games there to kind of try and draw in an audience but I think I'm at the point now, you know, especially since I've been trying to do this for 10 plus years, I'm ready to just do what I want because I have a huge back catalog of games that I really want to play. And some of them I've already kind of played on my own, but I kept thinking, you know what, this will be great if I just play it live. And if someone wants to watch it, great. If someone doesn't want to watch it, that's fine too, because you know, I'm in a position now where if this is gonna be a thing for me, cool. If not, I'm just gonna do this for fun because I love interacting with you guys uh, live and stuff like that um, while I play games. Um, I think it's honestly one of the coolest things. It's one of the biggest things in the streaming community. So that's what I really wanna focus on when I get back into live streaming. I don't know if it's gonna be this year, uh, but because like I said, I want to finish these first few projects before I move on back to live streaming. Um, and with, you know, even with that said, I want to try and focus on that. The other kind of, you know, the playthroughs and stuff, they're nice, but most of those don't really get, you know, the views. I mean, they get views, but it's not like it's really pushing out towards a specific audience or whatnot. So uh, because there's obviously a whole bunch of other smaller creators just you know trying to take the same steps that i'm doing and basically just trying to put myself out there they're, you know they're trying to put their selves, themselves out there as well this is starting to just turn into a little hobby of mine something to keep me young something to keep me happy with life and something that maybe hey you know my kids can grow up kind of watch you know you know when when they get a little older just to kind of see what i was trying to do um that's all I really want to do. And hey, if it were, if it turns out great, then cool. I will I will ride the wave. And you know, hopefully those of you guys that have stayed uh, stayed this course with me, you know, will continue to do the same as well. With that said, uh, I just want to say thank you. Thank you for sticking with me. Those of you that have done that, um, 
like I said, I'm not going away, and I just want to. I just want to come back and do what I love to do, and that's play games. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and drive home because I am tired. I'm ready to start relaxing, take a week off of work, focus on family time, and getting back into what I love, and that's playing some games with you guys. So, um, thank you guys. I'll see you guys real soon. Can't wait for you guys to see what's to come next. So, take care, and as always, peace, love to y'all, and I'll see you soon. Take care.